stay up all night singing songs on the terrace. We didn't mind sitting out in the cold. Hello, you guys. Welcome to my channel, or welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hi, hello. My name is Jenny, my husband's name is Jacob, and we have one daughter named Ivana together, as well as sometimes my eight-year-old sister, Nicole, will come just to hang out for the day or something. But today is actually day number one, again, of being a solo mommy. Now, I'm not a single mommy, I am a solo mommy, which basically means that I am a stay-at-home mom. My husband is an over-the-road truck driver. He actually... He's been a truck driver for like two years now and today is his first day back on the road. If you watch your weekend vlog, I'll, I'll link it somewhere up here. Um, yeah, you will get to see his truck and the inside of his truck and all that fun stuff. But today is day number one of being a solo mommy. Again, I do have to tell Ivana that daddy did leave. He did go with me to drop Ivana and Nicole off at school so they did get to see him before he left. Mostly Ivana because Nicole doesn't live with us. But I do have to go pick her up and kind of tell her that daddy's not coming home tonight, which is really sad. Welcome to an after school day in the life of a solo mommy. We are actually heading out. We're going to have to leave soon. It is 10.53 right now and oh my gosh. I'm also on my tippy toes by the way. Like, yeah, I'm on my tippy toes. Um... We have to pick up Ivana around 11.20, so we're going to go ahead and do that. Also, I just want to quickly say, Jacob, if you're watching this, I miss you so much. So, today's probably going to be kind of filled with emotions, just because I don't know how Ivana's going to take it. I definitely will have to get her readjusted. Um, but yeah, I miss him so much. And he literally just left like an hour ago. And he's going to be coming by, he's going to be coming back at least once during the week and then the weekends, of course. And his boss seems really cool. Like, his boss said if he needs more time at home, he can definitely have more time at home. But I miss him. Alright, let's go get Ivana. That way I'm distracted for a little bit. to your heartache if you want to open your door mm. i'm feeling kind of lost when your mind is hiding whatever that is choking your chest i can see it in your eyes that you're shaking cause you're holding it back My hair is such a mess. <laughs> we are back home. Ivana says she had a really great day in school. So that's good. I put my Christmas jammies on just because I, I didn't want to be in jeans. Oh, I just got a hair 
a mouthful of your hair. Seeing in your eyes that you're shaking cause you're holding it back. Mm -hmm. Maybe you'll make up your mind now I'm here by your side. Mm -hmm. So let it all out of me. Let it all out of me. Oh, I will hold you in the dark, make you forget about what's wrong. Let it all out of me. I can see it in your eyes that you're shaking, cause you're holding it back. Mm -hmm. Maybe you'll make up your mind now. be able to see me because of the window behind me but Ivan and I have been playing for about half an hour or so in around 15 minutes um, I'm gonna go ahead and put laundry away and then once I'm done with laundry we're gonna go play outside for a little bit I do have to go pick up the neighbor kids um, I pick up my neighbor's daughters she has two daughters they're like six and eight years old they literally live Mm -hmm. They live across the train tracks from us. Not really much to say. Mm -hmm. So yeah, we're gonna keep playing with the Barbie dolls or baby dolls. Baby sorry, dogs. and then we're gonna do some laundry. Dream up a world of pirates. I'm the highest tree. Number two for myself has just ended. I just cried for a little bit just because she missed, my, she missed daddy. Yes, just because I do miss him. I miss him a lot. Um, and like I've been telling a couple of people that I'm talking to, like I'm talking to Jenna from Mega Mom and I'm talking to Carissa from 
Chris and Shaylin about this whole thing and just how I've been feeling and stuff like that. Um, I understand that, and I think I've said this before too, I understand that there is other couples out there who go months, months, if not years, without seeing their significant other and they have to kind of like find a way to live life without their best friend. Um, and I understand that. And I know that that's not what's happening to me. I know that... Can you me? Yeah, one second. I know that I am not going a month to a year without seeing Jacob. And I know that Ivana is not going a month to a year without seeing her dad. It's just, he's still my best friend. I am a stay-at-home mom, so I don't really do anything during the day, social-wise. He is the only other person that I talk to every single day. Meltdown number three is about to happen. Um... And so the fact that I have to find an, like, how do I say it? The fact that I have to find a, a new routine that's just like our old routine before, like, he he was coming home every night, it's just, it's a little hard. It's, it's hard. I know I'm going to miss him dearly, and I know that this is going to make our relationship stronger because, hey, I said just wait a minute, okay? It's just, I kind of know what to do is what I'm trying to say. Um... It doesn't mean that it doesn't hurt any less and it's not like a painful hurt it's just more like a sad sad hurt right now it is about 2 45 so Ivana really wants to go play on her bike and we're gonna go play on her bike it's normally weather pending if we're going outside or not and then we're gonna go get our neighbor girls and then we're gonna go to Mima's house and then we're gonna come back home, home. <laughs> anyway, let's call it a day Okay, you guys, and that is going to be the end of today's video. I am so sorry about how emotional I was getting. I just really, really miss my husband, but there's no time to be sad when you have a little one depending on you to be happy. Look at how cute she is. Oh my gosh, I can't. I really hope you enjoyed my little day in the life of a solo mommy here. I can't wait to make more solo mommy content for you guys. I really did miss doing that. If you liked today's video or if you can kind of relate to today's video, then please consider joining my YouTube family. It really does help support my channel and it really does keep me going, you guys. You have no idea how much it means to me. Anyway, you guys, thank you so much for tuning in. I really hope you enjoyed it and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye. To make us embarrassed, we were free. Do you remember stealing smokes from your parents? Sometimes we got a bit out of control.